What's up guys? Welcome back to another street food video by Pair of Souls. We're here in wonderful Bahal, Philippines. Uh, we're at the coastal town of Gindelman. It's a population of about uh, 35,000 people here. Uh, it's almost 5 o'clock, so that's a good thing. It means there's a lot of street food here. Everyone's going to be coming to get a snack before heading home. Uh, I just found a good spot here. Uh, we're going to see what they've got. I've got 100 pesos in my pocket. That's what I have to spend for around $2.50 Canadian. So yeah, we're going to see what they got guys. Peace. Okay, so this one's the vinegar and this, this that's a spicy one no that's, oh, that's a regular that's this regular spicy. This is spicy this is no. the sauce that's the sauce okay i'll have the spicy please spicy no yes. sauce uh no sauce no only vinegar just a bit of vinegar yeah i gotta watch my my stomach <laughs> awesome thank you so much thank you you're welcome all right so here we go i got the this is a famous street food in the philippines it's called quick quick basically a uh, quail egg and they put like this batter on it and I think it's like a food coloring to make it turn orange but um, that was great so I'm gonna try that and then it's also a, a tempura I got on top here he's cooking it right now I'll show you guys this is a tempura that's a tempura and that was the quick quick yes and this is the the oh, okay. intestine of the chicken. Yes, yes, it's very good that one. Very nice. So there we go. As you see, it's, a, it's attached to his, his motorbike, so he can, he's mobile with this. He can go wherever he wants. Here, it's uh, pretty good. He's got his umbrella because it's so hot. So he's got his umbrella. He can go anywhere. Uh, if it's busy in a certain area, he can move his, his stall. So I'm going to go try to find a place to sit so I can try this. I'll try to find a, a place here. Up there. Ah, nice, perfect. <laughs> All right. Hey, what's that? All right, I'm gonna sit up here. My nice spot. I'm gonna sit right here. I got my tempura and quail egg. All right, I've got my. That's a tempura. And like you saw him do, he put like a vinegar on it and also like, it looks like chopped onion. Mm. Very good guys, nice and spicy. And that's the quack quack. So that's, um, they're pretty much like um, miniature hard boiled eggs. If you've seen quail eggs, we have those back, back home. Uh, here they're very popular. And like I said, they're deep fried with this batter. That was great. That was about 25 pesos. Like I said, I have 100 pesos to spend. So that was about one, one fourth of my budget so far. We'll see you guys at the next spot. All right guys, we're at spot number two. I saw this guy before, same little thing. Um, his is not attached to a motorcycle. His is attached to a bike. He's got a bunch of stuff here. Hello, Kuya, how are Okay, lang. What's your name? Jai? Jive. Jive. Okay, I go see Chris, bro. Nice to meet you. Unsa ni? Is this uh, chicken or pork? Chicken. Chicken. Okay. All right. So a little different than the other place. If you guys remember the uh, the other chicken street food I did? They had like kind of like a little restaurant set up. His is uh, mobile, so he's ready to go wherever he wants. He's got a whole bunch of different sauces here. You can choose any one, super cool. Dip away, no double dipping. There you go. Okay, Kuya, I will get uh, one of the chicken, please. Thank you, Pilana. 20. Okay. So, this one also, guys, this one's uh, 20 pesos. Okay, I will grab uh, 20 pesos. There we go, bro. All right. So he's asking me what kind of sauce I want. Which one's the best one? Hot sauce. The hot sauce? The hot sauce? Sure, I'll try the hot sauce. Nice, bro. All right, I'm gonna enjoy. 
Thank you very much. I'm gonna have a sit here. Right behind the guy, you see they're cooking in the back here. It's pretty cool. Again, I'm not sure if they're here all day, these guys, but usually uh, the busy times are in the like late afternoon when people are finishing work. So I think it's like 4 p.m. So it's gonna get busy here soon. All right, it's very hard to film in the market, guys, because of all the music that's playing. So I don't want to get a copyright strike, so I have to had to get out of there quickly. I'm gonna walk around here, see what they've got. Need something to drink. Actually, if I could find something to drink, that would be perfect. So we're gonna do that. What's up, bro? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Bobby. Bobby, Akosi Chris. Yes, nice to meet you. Yes. I love these vehicles here. <laughs> yes, 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 original. Yeah. I'm looking for something to drink. I'm so thirsty. I don't know if they have maybe a restaurant there. Whew. They have also there? Okay, I'll check. Thanks again, Bobby. Take care. We about the bake shop to get something to drink, but I'd like to find maybe something a little different. So I think here they got like Coca-Cola, stuff like that. Looking for something a bit more, uh, you know, traditional. <laughs> See what we got. What's up, bros? <laughs> Everyone's in a good mood. It's great. It's never boring. Everyone wants to say hi. I gotta walk on the side of the road, not in the middle of the road. <laughs> Just because I'm filming does not give me the right to uh, obstruct the roads. Do you want one of those? I can buy you one of those. No? No money, but I can buy you one of those if you want. No? No, 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 I'm asking, do you want one of those? Okay. So here we are, we found another spot here. Uh, that was after my chicken. Uh, I don't know what these are, but uh, I'm gonna try it out. Hello, Paul. What's it? What's it? Cassava balls. Mm, cassava balls, okay. So that's a, like, it's like a, kind of like a potato. And uh, take pilang for a piece. 10 pesos. 10 pesos, okay, per stick. Okay, so it's 10 pesos per stick. Uh, I'm gonna buy one for the lady here. She's asking me for money uh, instead of giving money because you don't know if they're gonna use it for alcohol or whatever. So I'm gonna buy them something to eat if she still wants it. It's okay? All right, so we're gonna buy her, her a cassava ball. She has a baby. We'll get her some food, guys. No bag for me, Tay, it's okay. Uh, no bag, it's okay. Uh, well, I'm bag, it's okay. I'm trying to not use as much bags as possible. Oh! Okay. Okay, welcome. Alright, I got my cassava ball here. I'm gonna try this. Oh, thank you. Cassava balls. And I'm guessing it's coconut. Oh, is it coconut around or? Yes. Coconut? Okay, so it's cassava balls uh, with coconuts. Looks like it's dipped in coconut. These were uh, 10 pesos each. I got two. One for the lady, one for me. Mm. Not bad. Good. Starchy. Sweet because of the coconut. Not bad. Looks like she's doing something else here. It looks like a some sort of pancake with chocolate syrup. That's way too. I'm way too full for that. I'm gonna have problems finishing this up. Oh man. Whew. So I'm at 65 pesos. I need to spend 35. Wow. All right, well, I told you guys at first I had 100 pesos to spend on street food, so I didn't think that was fair to start going to buy a beer or something to drink. So, hello guys. 
<laughs> they can't wait for me to go buy some food. So uh, I have to spend it on food. I think I have 45 pesos left. So that's what I'm gonna try to spend here. It looks like they have a little different variety and they have some nice, uh, looks like Mansi juice, calamansi juice. Calamansi juice. Calamansi juice. And they've got a different selection here. Take care of sauce. Nice, nice selection also, here. Also, nice sauce. But <laughs> <laughs> well, we have to get names. We always have to get names. So I, in Bisaya, I asked you, Punsa Imong Pangalan? Ako Pangalan? Pangalan. Ako Pangalan. Indai. No, but your real name. My real name, Glenda. Glenda, okay. Okay. Uh, ako si Chris. Uh, Glenda. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nai? Nimpa. Nimpa. Nimpa, okay. Nice to meet you. Ako Chris. I think that's it. Then we got some customers. I will first try the calamansi juice. This was 10 pesos. I'm so thirsty. Mm, very nice. Calamansi is that like a miniature lime. They're all over the Philippines. People have uh, the trees in their backyards, uh, front yards. It's great. It's sweetened a little. And they've got ice, of course. So nice cold drink. All right, I'm going to put that down. And we got this here. So this is called isal. So this is that uh, chicken intestine, but it's not just done after that. They also bread it and deep fry it. And you have your choice of sauce over here. You can choose which one. Very good. I think I'm just going to pour it in my cup. I think that's the easiest way. So that's what I'm going to do here. Try not to make a mess. Actually, I'll put it over here. Pour my sauce in that. Mm. I'll try this one. I don't know what it is. I'm going to try it. Just a little. Don't want those added calories, right guys? Street food, nice. Yeah, it's the Isao. Mm. So good. Mm. Have you, if you check out any of our other street food videos, yeah, you see me eating this one, but it's not breaded. It's just the intestine on the barbecue grill with the sauce. It's one of my favorite uh, Filipino uh, barbecues here. So good. Awesome. I'm sorry. I still have five pesos left. I couldn't spend that last five. That was my 100 peso street food here in Gindelman, in Bahal, in the Philippines. Hope you guys love the video. Take care, guys. Peace.